Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Big Mike here. Um, it's Friday, uh, the day after uh, Thanksgiving, and sorry about the bumpy road. I'm getting ready to get up on the, the uh, highway here, leaving our small town, and uh, we are heading to Durant, Oklahoma to the Harbor Freight there, uh, the Lowe's, and then uh, I'm going to meet Terry and uh, Brittany in Sherman, Texas, uh, where we're going to do some Black Friday shopping, uh, get some of the stuff. Let me fix this. Um, but what I'm looking for is I'm looking for a, the Harbor Freight uh, large uh, mixer uh, to mix concrete. Um, so we're going. I'm going there, uh, and then they're going straight to Sherman, and then we'll meet up there once I find what I'm looking for. Hopefully, I find it, and if I don't find it in Durant, Oklahoma, I'm going to. Uh, try over there in Sherman at the Harbor Freight there so that's what we're doing today it's a clear day it's 23 degrees outside here in Oklahoma day after Thanksgiving and boy did we eat yesterday uh, my son and the kids and his wife they all came down uh, from Oklahoma City and we ate and we ate and we ate Terry did a bang-up job her and Brittany um, they did a turkey, and if you looked at our videos, she did a little short on what she prepared, but, boy, I had, like, nightmares last night. <laughs> I was so full. Oh, my gosh. And uh, But we made it, and then uh, we're doing, like I said, Black Friday shopping, and uh, I guess we, we took two vehicles because Brittany wants to, I guess, buy my Christmas presents. You don't want me to be around and stuff. So, but we'll take some video, whatever they allow us to do in the stores and stuff like that. And, uh, you know, what do you do after Thanksgiving? You do the black, black Friday sale, right? So anyway, I hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. Um, and, uh, you were with family, friends, and, uh, I hope God's good to you for, uh, the rest of the year or the new year coming up so anyway i won't jibber jabber here uh the next thing you should see is me going into harbor freight and seeing if they got the stuff i want and uh hopefully i'll i'll be happy and we get a good deal so anyway yeah because it's always about the good deal right anyway i'll talk to you soon that's all that's 14 bucks i mean that ain't bad how do you use it you gotta wash the cars well, she always goes down the dirt roads with her BMW and she can wash it. <laughs> you need that power washer though. We do. I can't believe they won't give you the mixture that's a tat, I mean, already put together. Mm. You just set that in the back of the truck, right. strap it down. Absolutely. We're good to go. Sounds like not required. Do you want to walk? Huh? Oh, I'm not awake. It's too early. I haven't even had breakfast yet. Probably. There's nobody here that we're fighting elbow to elbow with, by the way. I know, it's kind of weird, isn't it? What the heck, Dad? I'm get a couple of these things. Black Friday fighting. Yeah, okay. Let's go get breakfast. Maybe that's just at, uh, at the Walmart. Is that what you want for Christmas? The Walmart, they go in there and they start... Oh yeah, Walmart's yeah. A, an animal house. Yeah. Dad wants sponges for Christmas. See, I have, I have every, everything that I want, it's like big. the big presses it's and stuff big. like that, is huge. Yeah. But see, they have these right here. These will fit right on my workbench. I don't need a huge drill. That's one fifty nine. There you go, Dad. Do you want that? That'd be cool. Hey, uh, we just finished in Durant, Oklahoma. Uh, we went to the Harbor Freight. Uh, I think
think Terry took some uh, video of that. Uh, they didn't have the mixer I wanted, so they have one coming in on Monday, so I put a rain check on that, and they're going to call us when it comes in. I, I'm going to send Terry down there since I have to work Monday, and Terry will come down and pick it up in the Jeep. They say it'll fit, so we'll do that. Uh, they had a planer. I really didn't want to spend that much money on a planer that I'm only going to use once in a great while, so it didn't really make sense. They did have Jackery's uh, on sale there, but Terry said, well, well, let's get a Jackery. And I said, well, I don't really need a Jackery. And she said, well, Brittany said, well, you can use it on your boat or something like that. But my boat's a modern modern man's uh, boat. It's got USB ports. It's got all kinds of stuff on there. Electrical plug-ins <clears throat> from my uh, battery banks and underneath the uh, floorboard of the, the boat and stuff, the deck. So I don't really need that. So I thought that would be a waste of money. If I was off-grid, yeah, it would make sense to get it. Um, but then I seen uh, a drill press that would work in my shop that I can put on, bolt down onto my workbench. So it's a 10 inch uh, drill press. Uh, I don't need the big tall stand up one. I just need one to, to go on my workbench. So that's on the list now. Um, and I need a vise uh, for my workbench. So that's on the list now. And what else? We were gonna look at pressure washers, but they just have the cheap ones in there. And if anybody ever bought a pressure washer, you know, when you buy cheap, that's what you get. So, we'll keep looking for that one. Uh, so, we're going to go ahead now to Sherman. We're just now crossing into Texas. Welcome to Texas. Drive friendly. We will kick you out. But uh, we're on our way to Sherman. We're going to go to have breakfast at the Cracker Barrel. There's the police officer. Um, and we'll have breakfast and with the gals. And then we will turn around and go over to Academy Sports. Because you can't come to Sherman without going to Academy Sports. So we're going to do that. My, my phone's kind of bouncing because of these Texas roads. Um, and it's leaning to one side. But I'm not going to adjust that while I'm driving. And uh, then the girls are going to go over to some of the uh, girly stores. And then they're going to go to Hobby Lobby to get decorations, more decorations for Christmas. And uh, I'll go to Lowe's. I'll go to Orsland Farm at Home and uh, see what we can get into, see what we can buy. And I hope you guys stay tuned. We'll try to get as much of this video and done as possible. Okay? Alright. First we're going to eat breakfast. Mikey's hungry. Mikey likes to eat. Even after that big dinner last night. My gosh. So anyway, stay tuned. There's more to come. Alright, so if you've never been to, to Sherman, uh, this is it.
All right, we've made it to the Cracker Barrel. And uh, let's go in here and get some meats. There's Terry. It is a 15-minute wait. 15? 50. I guess we're not eating at Cracker Barrel. <laughs> I think there's an IHOP down this way. Yeah, we can look around. Okay. But 50 that. minutes, that's a long wait. Yeah. You know why? Because Sad didn't want to fight everybody on Black Friday. Guess what we didn't do? Fight everybody. You know why? Because nobody doesn't go anywhere on Black Friday. They do online shopping. So, we went to Harbor Freight and got nothing because Dad couldn't find what he wanted. Well, he did, but they didn't have it. But he wasn't fighting anybody over it. And now, we just left Cracker Barrel because there's a huge long wait, but Cracker Barrel's always packed, so that's whatever. But we did get some Christmas presents. But anyway, long story short, now we're still driving around, haven't got anything, and we're hungry, and I haven't had coffee. We're going to the next stop, which is Horseland's Farm and Home. See what they got in there for sale, just to see. Um, it's still here in uh, Sherman. We ate breakfast at the IHOP, and that was good. So now, there's the ladies right there. There they are. By pretty your side. Pretty always. as the days long. Oh yeah. They're here. They're following me because they don't trust me. Getting ideas for Christmas. Okay. That's the excuse. So we made it in. That's sad, my head still turns when the kid says, hey dad. Ooh, look at that. See that smoker. Wow. Smokers. So anyway, we don't even know what we're getting into. We do need some rabbit. Okay. Some Timothy. We're gonna need a cart. Here's here's what I do miss about. And oh, by the way, Hi. we're at the next place. And hello. hello. We're going to all these. Well, that's the thing about living in a in a bigger town than what we live in. Because you come here, you got restaurants. You got Sam's Club. Okay. You got Sam's Club. You got the Aldi. You got the Harbor Freight, you got the Boot Barn, and you got Tractor Supply in one parking lot. A man doesn't need more than that. And dental. Oh, and the Rib Crib. <laughs> and dental. Dental, uh, optical. your optical, <laughs> medical devices, and a phone company. Why not? One parking lot here in uh, Sherman, Texas. So we're gonna go into Harbor Freight and might go down to heart to uh, tractor supply, but you haven't been in all these in a while, have you? No, I wanted to go in all Yeah, all so there. the women folk are gonna go to all these. After we go to Harbor Freight. And after they go to Harbor Freight to keep an eye on me. I know that's what they're doing. They're saying, oh, we're just trying to get Christmas ideas. My butt. <laughs> Terry don't trust me. Oh, are they selling these Ram trucks here? <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go into Harbor Freight here, see what we can get into, and we'll see you when we're done. All right, so we got done with Tractor Supply, and we went to Harbor Freight, Terry and then went into Aldi's, 
And now we're over here at Academy Sports and Outdoors. So we're going to go in there and do some purchasing and we'll see you when we get out. Well, whew, we just got done with Academy. I really didn't see a whole lot, um, but Terry met me there. So did my daughter, Brittany, and we walked through there. Got my son-in-law a uh, Christmas gift. Um, wish I could have got more, but they only let you have four boxes of the gift stuff. And yeah. Ooh. So we did that and I am done buying. Uh, thank my daughter for the gift she bought me. It was relatively busy day. I'm heading home. The girls are continuing to shop. Uh, they're going over to Hobby Lobby, Books A Million, Belks. Um, they're going to hit the, the big Walmart here and uh, finish up their shopping. I got what I needed and I'm going home. So I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the trip down here to Sherman, Texas with us. I know it wasn't that exciting, but hey, we're documenting everything. And I just want to wish everybody, I hope you guys had a happy Thanksgiving. I hope you guys are shopping early for Christmas. And uh, yeah, the weather is pretty nice down here, but uh, it's always good to get off the farm, the homestead, and be around other people, I guess. I thought it would be a lot more crazier than it was. The lines at Academy were like, every every cashier was open and there was eight to 10 people in each line. So they're doing good business. Uh, Harbor Freight, basically pretty much empty. Uh, and I think all that's because over the last two years, what we've been going through, uh, people are getting very, very used to shopping online uh ordering groceries you know you can now have you know sam's club costco amazon you name it order online it gets delivered to your house uh free shipping all that stuff so yeah i don't know i guess thing times are changing and uh the online shopping's doing great but I'm going to head back to Oklahoma. Uh, it's nice being down here in Texas. Uh, so, I don't know what to say. Um, Got to go back to work on Monday. And uh, back to the rat race. But Saturday, we'll probably do a short or something because we're doing Thanksgiving part two with the other part of the family coming over and uh, enjoying a, a dinner with us and uh, get to spend time with the other grandkids. So until next time, do, do something nice for somebody. Be kind to everyone and always, always think of that. And without the vets, we couldn't do what we we're, we're doing right now. So I love our country. I love you guys. And until the next video, be good. God bless. And we'll see you then. Bye.